Hello and welcome to the Daily Vigil Bible. I'm Robbie Yates. Let us see what the reading is for the 10th day of our Advent calendar. Well, if I ever needed evidence that I was human, capable of making errors, that should have read Romans chapter 9 verse 7, which reads, Neither, because they are Abraham's offspring, are they all children, but your offspring will be accounted as from Isaac. So as we see, it was the belief of the first century Christians that the Messiah had descended from Isaac. It's Numbers chapter 25 today. Let's open God's word of prayer. Lord, I ask that as I read your word, that you reveal something new to me. I also ask that as people see and hear your word, they come to better understanding with you. Amen. Numbers chapter 25. Israel stayed in Shittim, and people began to play the prostitutes with the daughters of Moab. For they called the people to the sacrifices of their gods. The people ate and bowed down to their gods. Israel joined themselves to Baal Peor. Yahweh's anger burned against Israel. Yahweh said to Moses, Take all the chiefs of the people and hang them up to Yahweh before the sun, that the fierce anger of Yahweh may turn away from Israel. Moses said to the judges of Israel, Everyone kill his men who have joined themselves to Baal Peor. One of the children of Israel came and brought to his brothers a Midianite woman in the sight of Moses and in the sight of all the congregation of the children of Israel while they were weeping at the door of the tent of meeting. When Phinehas the son of Eleazar, the son of Aaron the priest saw it, he rose up from the middle of the congregation and took a spear in his hand. He went after the man of Israel into the pavilion and thrust both of them through. The man of Israel and the woman threw a body. So the plague was stayed from the children of Israel. Those who died by the plague were twenty-four thousand. He always spoke to Moses, saying, Phineas, the son of Eleazar, the son of Aaron the priest, has turned my wrath away from the children of Israel, and that he was jealous of my jealousy among them, so that I didn't consume the children of Israel in my jealousy. Therefore say, Look, I give to him my contract of peace. It shall be to him, and to his offspring after him, the contract of an everlasting priesthood, because he was jealous for his God. I sought forgiveness for the children of Israel. Now the name of the man of Israel that was slain, who was slain when a Midianite woman, was Zimri, the son of Salu, a prince of the forest house among the Simeonites. The name of the Midianite woman who was slain was Kuzbi, the daughter of Zer. He was head of the people of a father's house in Midian. He always spoke to Moses, saying, Harass the Midianites, and strike them, for they harassed you with their wiles with which they have deceived you in the matter of Peor, and in the matter of Cosby. The daughter of the prince of Minion, their sister, was slain on the day of the plague, in the matter of Peor. Numbers chapter 26. 